the tutorial that almost every few more I use I've been waiting for. Hello my dear friends Alex here from Alex Edits. And in this tutorial I am bringing to you the most expected tutorial around the Filmora community. And this is how you can add effects, apply effects to your titles in the timeline without affecting anything else in the timeline. The challenge we have right here is quite complicated. When you drag down the effect from the effects tab, you cannot directly apply it to the titles in the timeline. And if you drag it onto the track above, everything below that track is also going to be affected, which is not what you want. And of course, we have been using other editing tricks to be able to achieve this mission. Like in this video right here, I was showing up a trick of using the green screen. And after that, you had to export that selected range of clips and then bring it back so that you can remove that green background using the chroma key feature. And just a few months after that, adjustment layers were introduced and that was in Filmora 12. And again, Again, right there, I showed yet another trick, but if you check them out, honestly, you'll find out these are only tricks, not actually the formal way of editing video. This time around, we got the perfect method of doing this. Alright, let's check it out. For a very simple example, my dear friends, my very first time of using this method, I was working on this church project right here, and I actually created something like this. This was nothing else but an effect applied onto the titles and I could also use this as a transition. Alright my dear friends, now we have a starting point, drag down any text you want or else you can add a quick text and now you can customize your text the way you want. And right here is for me, let me type something like the 31 December 2025, alright and I can also change the font. And now here is the climax of this whole video. Instead of trying to drag an effect onto this title right here, you must right select the title and then go for this option right here which is the compound clips. And right here of course you have to name your compound clip. And for my case I just name it 31 December 2025. And for example if you have made a certain mistake. You can double select this your compound clip right here or else you can just find it on this option right here. And now here you can correct all the mistakes. Okay? And now back to the main timeline. Now you have to go straight to the effects tab and then search for any effect that you want. For my case right here, let me search for the negative flicker and then drag it onto this compound clip right here. And again, I need the second effect and I'll search for the colorful lighting flares. And after that, here you are. This is how this method works. But before you leave my dear friend, if you really appreciate the knowledge that you have gotten from this video, just like and share the video and support this channel by subscribing. And that is all. You can check out one of my most useful tutorials right here. Bye. <laughs>